Me and my mother were able to head to Edison, New Jersey this weekend, and we were and I was able to get some pretty cool things while there. For instance, I did already have my Railway Series book, thanks to my mother. Thank you for that again. You're welcome. Okay, so while I was, I was able to get some signatures in here from Rick Sigelkow, Train King James, One Tram Band, Enterprising Engines 93, and the Master of Lemons, aka Lemmy. But that was not all I was able to get. I do not remember for the life of me who it was that drew this, but I was able to get this poster here that represents the sequence where Donald and Douglas are towing the galleon into Arlesboro for the museum in Sodor's Ledger of Lost Treasure. And of course, Sailor John on skiff just watching with his telescope. And then there was also an Ertl Reneus, new in packaging, Ertl Canal Boat, new in package, Ertl Scarlowi, new in package. I don't know where this crane is from, but it looks just like a tug's crane, so I'm gonna be using it in my videos. Then since it's kind of in the frame, I wanted to save this till last, but a Knapford Station middle section. I don't have the outer segments, unfortunately, but I mean, I was able to get this for $10, so I mean, I'll take what I can get, and I need one anyway. And then, Bachman Busy as a Bee James. I don't even think I have track to run this on. It's just cool to have it, because I really like this color scheme for him. A wooden railway white roof rusty. It is in relatively poor condition, but I mean, I'll it's just a cool item to have. And then the Dumbelow Gauge Edison, New Jersey headboard 3D prints. I do not yet have them painted. I am nowhere near talented enough to be able to paint these correctly. So I'll see if I can get one of my friends to do it instead. So yeah, this is basically the stuff I managed to get while in Edison this weekend. The signatures, the Ertles, whatever the crane is from, the poster, the headboards, the wooden railway items, and busy as a bee James. I've not yet taken those things out of package, the Ertle and the James. I might do videos on those at some point. I mean, it wouldn't be much of a video for James because again, no track to run on, but it's just cool to have. So that's the rundown. And to be clear, this Rusty will not be modified in any way or used in any of my videos for like a main series or anything. I actually have a wooden railway Rusty already that I've painted into this nice bluish gray color. In editing, I'll just put a picture of it up while I'm describing it. But when, if I'm gonna be doing narrow gauge shots for like in the wooden railway scale, which I absolutely will, I'll use that one instead. And with these, since I have permission from Lamy to do this, I'll see if I can adapt some sequences from Long Live the Iron Horse. Just for simplicity's sake, I'll just have Renee with a cab roof so I don't have to use a metal saw on anything. And I won't modify the paint jobs on these yet, because like, brand new, and I really don't want to have to go through that already. I've done it with the other Ertles, but not these ones yet, obviously. And I'm not going to do it to these ones for a while, if ever.